Hey, this is DCAB, and today we're going to go over the Dyson Supersonic, the Professional and Consumer Edition. This, this right here, this is the Dyson Supersonic, and we're going to be looking at this from a couple different perspectives. So let's jump in. Now, I mean, you've seen this hair dryer someplace, somewhere besides this video. That's what brought you to this video. Now, the Dyson Supersonic looks unique. It doesn't look like any other hair dryer on the market, at least not that I've seen, right? Now, the design cues come from Dyson. I mean, you look at it and it kind of looks like a miniaturized bladeless fan that they carry. And it works pretty well and it works almost in the same way that that bladeless fan does work. It has a miniaturized motor in the handle. It sucks in air. It blows it out through the bladeless portion at the top of it. But what's more interesting about how this hair dryer works is that all the weight is built into the handle, as opposed to the traditional hair dryer where you actually have the weight in the motor in the head of the dryer. If you're doing hair all day long, or if you're even doing yours and yours takes a while to do, your wrist will get tired and you get fatigued. So this one kind of helps you out with that. And that's what makes this really nice. Now the Dyson Supersonic does come in a few different colors. Uh, just off the top of my head, there's a black, there's a red, a silver, and a purple one out there. And you've probably seen one or two of these shades on their Instagram page or online or even in person if you've gone to one of the beauty supply stores. Now, one thing I would definitely recommend before making a purchase on one of these guys is to go and actually handle one of them at least. Uh, but again, depending on the color you get, some of them have a soft touch feel which feels grippy. And the other ones, kind of like the white silver, is a little bit more slick on the handle. So if you're going to be using it all day long, you probably want to get one with the soft touch finish on there because it'll make it easier for you to hold on to. So right out of the box, Dyson will give you a few different things. A styling concentrator, a smoothing nozzle, a diffuser, a non-slip heat mat, and a storage hanger with it. And depending where you purchase it, they may give you a traveling case as well. That comes in black, brown, pink, red, I've even seen. Um, they may give that to you for free, you might have to buy it separately, but I would check with Dyson's website first because it's usually a freebie that they give you. Now these attachments that come in the box, they're pretty slick. Uh, there's a magnetic ring built around the Dyson Supersonic and these attachments simply just click on and uh, I don't even know if click on is the right word they just kind of just click on and what's nice about it is that if you need to take it off you literally just pull it off so there's no more of uh, putting a, a nozzle on your hair dryer, it gets so hot that you have to really twist it to pull it off. This one is literally a magnetic piece. Click on and then click, it's off. It's pretty slick. There's also a professional edition of the Dyson Supersonic. There are a few differences from the professional edition to the consumer. One of them is going to be the longer cable, so at 11 feet it allows you to get around your chair a little more easier. It also has stronger magnetic attachments, so if you're someone that likes to hold uh, from the nozzle while you're doing hair, this one you won't have the feeling uh, that the hair dryer is going to fall off because of the way it magnetizes on there. It also has an air filter that's a lot easier to clean. And the most important part, if you are someone that holds it from the nozzle, it does come with a better concentrator. It actually is a little bit more narrow and more exact, so when you're working with hair, you're getting it to where you need it to be. So regardless if you get the consumer edition or if you get the professional edition of the Dyson Supersonic, they're going to operate pretty much the same way. Okay? Now, how you bought your hair dryer is more than likely you went into a store and you wanted the highest amount of wattage you could get. The higher the watts, the hotter it gets, the hotter it gets, the faster it dries hair. Well Dyson approaches this a little bit differently. Now it has this V9 motor in it which blows air incredibly fast, okay? Uh, it's like a wind tunnel coming out of this guy. And then the other part is it has a thermostat built in so it does get super hot However, it doesn't get hot enough to burn hair. So it regulates that 20 times a second in order to prevent burning of the hair. And since it comes out so fast, it allows it to dry quicker. So you're gonna get a better result using the Dyson Supersonic than you would any traditional hair dryer. Because again, a hair dryer that is of high value has usually a high wattage. And with the high wattage, it causes hair to burn. And then in the long term, you're gonna get a lot of split ends. 
So who is the Dyson Supersonic made for? Well, it's made for everyone, but more specifically, it's made for you. Uh, I mean, consider this. You saw this in the store. You saw it online. It got you to this video, so you're interested enough to look at this product. So is it worth it at 400 bucks? Well, absolutely. Yeah, I mean, if you do your hair multiple times a week and you have to dry it multiple times a week, and this is going to cut down your drying time multiple times a week, you're going to be saving a lot of time by just having the dryer. You're going to get a lot more time back to you. Okay? On the second part of it is that if you do have thick hair, you do have curly hair, you do have hair that's hard to work with, or you have hair that has a lot of split ends and you're not really sure why, try this one out. Look at someone's return policy regardless of what store you go to and see if this model will actually work for you. And chances are it's going to work better than any other hair dryer you've ever had. And on top of that, it's going to be definitely the coolest hair dryer you've ever had. And if you ever get a different hair dryer than this one, it's probably going to be less cool than this one unless it's the sequel to this hair dryer. So are you a stylist and you're on the fence about whether or not you should purchase this? The easy answer is absolutely, you need to purchase this. You, if you're a consumer, you might not need to purchase it. If you have the money, yes, make the purchase. If you're a stylist, you need this tool. Okay, You spend a lot of money on shears, you spend a lot of money on product, you spend a lot of money on your booth if you're renting, right? Why wouldn't you spend a lot of money on a hair dryer? Now, any hair dryer could be fine for you, right? This thing is a tool though. This will cut down your drying times for every head that's in your chair. How many heads do you help in a day? If this helps you shave 10 minutes off of each appointment, and you have at least four heads, let's just say, I mean, you're gonna shave 40 minutes off. That's 40 minutes more you could have gotten someone else in, or 40 minutes more to you where you could get back home to your family. Okay, so if you're gonna buy the Dyson Supersonic, okay, if you are a consumer, you're not a professional, um, find a deal. Find something with a free case, uh, go online. If you have a rewards card, go to that place that offers rewards points for making the purchase, stay in their rewards programs. Absolutely go ahead and do that. If you're a professional, go to Dyson's website, do not add the basket, go to the bottom and there's a phone number. Call the number, give them your license number, okay? They're gonna knock down that price for you and it's gonna be a good discount. The way I look at it, and I think it's the same way Dyson looks at it, is they're gonna get you a discount on the professional edition that's gonna be more catered to what your needs are. And when you have heads in those chairs, people are gonna be looking at you like, well, I could hear you while you're using this blow dryer, that's crazy, it's super quiet. They're gonna ask you about it, you're gonna tell them. And you're advertising the product for them. They have no problem giving you a discount just because you have a license. You see so many people in a day, in a week, in a month, in a year, that it's advertising for them. So don't buy it online. Go online, get the number to Dyson, give them a call, have your license ready for them, and get a discount. That's how we did that here. That's why this video is here right now. So yeah, at the end of the day, if you're a consumer, go online, find a deal, get your rewards points. If you're a professional, go to Dyson, find the professional edition, scroll all the way to the bottom, call the number. Either way, you guys can't go wrong. This thing is going to make your life a lot easier. For sure.